You kind of had like guys coming in and out from the college team do do some work with us. Uh, obviously, the guys that didn't make NCAA's who were at conference, you know, they took the week off and then they joined us, which was nice. So we added some people. You know, the the real like we were in the trenches like early February, I'd say it was like eight of us. You know, just doing really really tough stuff. Um, and you know, we've and now that we're all back together, it's much more. Uh, lively, I'll say. We got into uh, a pattern of six weeks uh, in a row. On Thursday mornings, we'd do four 100s stroke on 120 and 450s kick fast on a minute, long course meters, four rounds through it. So week one was butterfly, week two was backstroke, week three was breaststroke on 130. So we didn't know we were going to do that on week one. So he was like, we're going to do some butterfly this morning. We're like, yeah, big whoop. And then got hit in the face with 1,600 meters of butterfly really fast. And then we come in on week four, and he's like, we're going to go through it one more time. And that was all of February for us. So that was really uh, demanding. Fly was the most challenging to get through for me because I sink on butterfly long course without a, tra uh, without a technical suit on. Um, I think for me, breaststroke felt the best because um, I was winning on breaststroke, the breaststroke weeks. Those felt pretty good. And I actually... Um, Who were you beating? I was beating Bobby <laughs> and Katie. <laughs> so I'll take that. <laughs> um, those felt good because I could get into a rhythm of 14 or 15 strokes and, and drop my time throughout the 400s, whereas backstroke and butterfly, I'm just trying to maintain stroke count and time, which was really challenging because I would go up eventually you know, towards the end of the set. Outside of the, the two and the four free, um, do, you, do you have events that you're kind of targeting or focusing on? Yeah, I'll add the 100 free and the 2 am as well. Um, I really like swimming the 100 free on the first day. I feel like I, uh, towards the end of the meet, like, like the last day of NCAAs was always really challenging for me to get up and go my best 100 free. Versus the first day, I still have like really, really good pop. Obviously, it's the first event. Um, so I think if I execute a, hundred, a really good 100 free well, um, I would love to put myself in a position to swim a relay. Last year, I was seventh in the final. So I was just off making that relay team. Um, but I'm hopeful for, for a very good 100 free. But it's a secret right now. I'm not going to race it tomorrow because my freestyle doesn't feel good. 